by hare's breath and fox breath, by fawn's prattle, wolf's growl, by dawn's break and eve's ache, the story is told. By beetles click, ducks clack, by crow's murderous call, by rain spittle, snow's nap, the story is told. By dews drip and sun drape, by paths winding rote, by gates open, gates close, the stories wound up. The very first time that I read one of Jane's poems, I heard it as music. I heard it as a song. Uh, I've set one of the songs on this CD, and as I read it, I sang it. It just popped into my head. I, when I set her songs to music, it's never a, a decision. It's never, oh, I like this poem, I'm going to set it to music. It's insistence by the poem. The, the melody was there all the time, so I didn't have to go looking for it. It mailed itself to me and the moods that are present here uh, are, for me at least, really draw me in and um, really spark my imagination. Um, and it's sort of the emotional content underlying all of it that I find, I find really compelling. Working with professionals is sort of very exciting uh, because we set our egos aside and we get down to the work. If they say to me, this line is too long, or can I sing it this way, and I listen, I'm being a professional. If, they, if I say to them, hey, I think this needs to be faster, or I, <laughs> I say to Donna, you can't say dance, you have to say dance when you're recording that poem. She's professional, she goes and does it, and when she doesn't get it quite, we've got the guy in the studio. As a producer, what I'm looking to do is try to, try to uh, fit it together as seamlessly as possible both on a technical level and also on an emotional level, on a mood level. I want these things to dovetail into each other so that it is uh, seamless and um, presents itself in a very natural, organic sort of way. This isn't going to be a fiddle extravaganza. The fiddle is like seasoning in a delicious stew rather than the main dish. And I'm always, uh, of course, asking people how they feel, because I want to get outside affirmation from, especially from the folks I'm working with here, because uh, we have a lot of very strong opinions and people have very good ideas. It's an amazing process and I love it. It's wonderful to work with these three people because it's always exciting. Something magical always happens when we get together and um, in certain periods of time when politics get you down, or a child is wailing, or uh, I got three rejections in the mail that day. I've got these people who I can call, who I can write to, who I can say, I want to hear something wonderful. And they're there. They're there. So, I love this CD. <laughs> Flowers grow within a neat and ordered row. But in our woodland, never neat, grow jumbled rows and meadows sweet. Yes, in our woodland, never neat, grow jumbled rows and meadows sweet. And Lily Bell, Queen Anne's lace, and Tandy. Between my lips, your ear is the story you should hear. But that is not the tale you find. You shape a tale to fit your mind. And so it goes in recreation. Mouth to ear, resuscitation, 
resurrecting what we hear, for truth lies tween the mouth and ear.